Hello. When setting up an Oracle Content and Experience instance as a primary account administrator, you can create your instance using the Oracle Cloud Console. If you are not the primary account administrator, then additional steps are necessary and you should refer to the documentation. Log on to Oracle Cloud Console with your existing account, or if you're a new user, use the information sent in your welcome email and change your password if prompted. On the console homepage, open the side menu and expand Application Integration, then select Content and Experience. When creating a new instance, you need to choose a storage compartment. The easiest option is to select the root storage compartment. You can find out more about storage compartments from the Oracle Help System. Once you've selected a storage compartment, click Create Instance. Enter a name for the instance and an optional description, then click Create. That's it. It takes a little while to create the instance, and the page will refresh automatically to help you follow the status. Once the provisioning is complete, you can access the instance details by clicking the instance name and go to the instance from there by clicking Open Instance. Also at this point, you can create groups, add users, and assign roles. Having an enterprise user group for each instance of Oracle Content and Experience Cloud allows you to easily add new users that will automatically have the proper roles for complete enterprise level tasks per instance. To create a group, Open the side menu, expand Identity, then click Federation. Open the Identity Cloud Service Console for your identity provider, and click Groups, and then Add. It's a good idea to reference the Oracle Content and Experience Cloud instance when naming the group. For example, if you have an instance for a company named Zalco, name the enterprise group Zalco CEC Enterprise Users. That way, if you have multiple instances requiring different roles for enterprise users, you can keep them organized. After you've named the group and added an optional description, click Finish. Once the group is created, you can move on to assigning roles to the group. After creating an enterprise user group for a specific content and experience cloud instance, you must assign the group four core roles to give the people in the group enterprise level access. Those four roles are Content Administrator, Enterprise User, Repository Administrator, Sites Administrator. To do this, start on the Details page of the newly created group and click Applications in the side menu. Locate the application mapped to the instance, in this case CECS underscore Zalco CEC, and open it. Click Application Roles. One at a time, find each of the four core roles and select Assign Groups from the Role menu. Select the Zalco CEC Enterprise Users group and click Assign. After the four core roles are assigned, you're ready to add users to the group. After creating a group and assigning the roles you intend group members to have, you can create new members and assign them to the group. For example, after creating the Zalco CEC Enterprise Users group and assigning the four key roles for enterprise-level tasks, click Users in the side navigation to go to the Users page of Identity Cloud Service. Click Add, enter the name and email address, then click Finish. Once the user is added, click Groups in the side navigation. Open the group you want, in this case Zalco CEC Enterprise Users, and click the Users tab. Click Assign, then find and select the user or users you want added to the group and click OK. Added users receive an email with a temporary password which they must use to accept and change their password. Users are synced with the Content and Experience instance automatically, but if you need to speed up the process, you can sync them manually. Once you've created and assigned a new user to a group, syncing them with the instance is done from the Content and Experience User Administration page. To start, log on to the Infrastructure Console, open the Side menu, expand Application Integration, and select Content and Experience. Click the Active Instance name to go to the Details page and click Open Instance. Open the Side menu, click Settings, and select Users from the Settings page menu. Click Sync Profile Data, then click OK. That's it! Any users you've added or group dependencies you assigned are synced for use with this content and experience instance, and once users have accepted and changed their temporary passwords, they can log in. For more information, visit cloud.oracle.com content.